Hello, this is uh, Marcus with Aquarium Hacks by Marcus. And today I'm just going to talk about a subject that I know can be highly debated and things of that nature. But it's about aquarium plants and ammonia. Um, now, I made an earlier video that I made some, some years ago about my testing with aquarium plants and ammonia. Now, in that video, I had a lot of fish and I had a ton of plants. And um, this is when I was cycling my tank. And at that time, and I had floating plants, I had an Amazon, uh, I had Amazon frog bit, I had go to pothos, I had all these plants you see here, and I had a lot of plants. And I would check my up for ammonia like every day and I did that for like two weeks, maybe, uh, maybe probably closer to three weeks, honestly. And for the first two weeks, solid two weeks, I had a reading. I know on that video I had on that reading that said uh, uh, point, 0 0.25 parts per million ammonia. Um, but it was actually closer to 0 0.50 ammonia or 0 0.50 uh, parts per million uh, ammonia in that tank. And I had that for almost two solid weeks. Now the fish got through it very well, uh, of course, because I was doing water changes and stuff like that. Um, but I did not see much of a decrease of ammonia uh, coming from the aquarium plants. And I had a lot of plants, a lot of plants. Um, and so it made me think, well, do aquarium plants take up a lot of ammonia? Well, in my case, it did not now my nitrates now i tested my nitrates and my nitrates were so low uh, because the plants was taking up so many nitrates that i actually had to um add nitrates in my aquarium uh, because my nitrates were so uh low i actually had to add some because the plants were aggressively taking up the nitrates i did not test for nitrite but i did test for ammonia and I did not see much of a decrease in ammonia. Now, could this be because of the case, because I had a lot of fish and a lot of plants? It could be, um, you know, uh, could it be the case uh, because I didn't, have, uh, I didn't have less fish? If I had less fish and a lot more plants, uh, would the plants might have taken up more ammonia? It's possible, because why do I say that? Because people with uh, uh, tanks that don't have any filters on them um, but they just have a few fish very few fish a few selected fish may I add and a lot of plants they don't get ammonia readings because the plants is able to take up uh, the ammonia that those few fish is producing but if you got a case like I have here a lot of fish and a lot of plants now here is a different situation because there's so many fish, and even though there's a lot of plants, the fish are producing far much too much waste uh, all the time for these, even all these plants to even keep up with. Now, let me tell you something. Now, if I truly believe that plants, uh, all these plants would, would take up all the ammonia in this tank with all these fish, then I would have no reason, and you would have no reason as well, to run your filters. Turn off your filters for about a week or two and just let your plants do all the work and see if you have an ammonia spike or not within about a week or two. If you have an ammonia spike, then you know the amount of plants that you have compared to your fish is not enough to take up the ammonia, the ammonia in your tank. Because I'm going to tell you something, I guarantee you and like I said, this is something that's been debated. But I guarantee you, with this amount of fish and even with all these plants that I got, and look at all them plants. I mean, so many plants, you can't hardly even see through the tank. But I've got like probably 75, 80 fish in here or, or more, plus snails, right? Snails, fish, and all that. But I guarantee you, if I was to shut off my filters, these filters here, completely and just leave them off, and just let these plants just do all the work, I guarantee you, guarantee it, that I would have an ammonia spike. And the reason why I say that is because from the beginning when I was trying to cycle this tank, 
and I had um, and I had the filters running and I had the plants in here and I had all the fish I continue to have that 0 0.50 or 0, 0 0.50 parts per million then it finally went down to 0 0.25 parts per million for about two weeks two uh, two weeks and then I think around about the third week it finally cycled but why did it truly cycle with the ammonia because my beneficial bacteria started to do most of the work now I'm not saying that plants don't take up some ammonia uh, they definitely do to do that because like I said it's been proven that you can have a few fish and a lot of plants and you can have a cycle tank that's been proven but on my case a lot of fish and a lot of plants the plants just cannot keep up with all the fish waste by themselves um, now uh, will plants take up nitrates? Uh, yes, uh, I've 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 seen it in my own case. My nitrates stay low in this tank. Why? Because the plants are constantly taking it up. Will the plants take up nitrite? I don't know. I didn't really test for nit uh, nitrite. By the time my tank was cycled, I tested for nitrite, and uh, my nitrites and my ammonia and all that was just was just fine. Um, but will plants, you know, with a lot of fish in it, take up a, a, a lot of uh, ammonia? In my opinion, they probably won't take up that much. If you truly feel that plants will take up a lot of ammonia in your tank, if you truly feel that way, have this many fish and this many plants in your tank. And after you run your filters for a while, shut your filters off. Shut them off. If you... If that's what you want to do, if you if you want to take that chance, shut them off for a week or two. Do your test results and see if your ammonia has risen any. If your ammonia has risen any, has risen, then you know your plants are not taking up much ammonia. Not saying that they won't take up some ammonia, because I honestly believe they will take up some. But where they take up a whole heap of ammonia to actually cycle your tank and nitrite and nitrate. Um, to actually get that complete cycle as far as ammonia is concerned no nitrate is concerned yes plants will take up a lot of nitrates uh, to the point to where you might even have to add it into your tank but in my in my opinion um, that I've tested for and I've tested for a long time with this like I said between that uh, week and three week period they just did not take up a lot of uh, ammonia um, I've talked to other fish keepers and uh, other people at pet stores and other people that have kept fish and they have told me the same thing. So it's not just my opinion. Um, it's, it's the opinion of other people uh, that work in the fish hobby, uh, work at the aquarium stores uh, that keep fish uh, have said the same thing to me. Uh, but like I said before, I honestly believe it will work with the right amount of fish, a few fish and a lot of plants. I honestly believe it will work like that. Uh, it will be some work to get it to that point, but I believe it will work like that But if you have a lot of fish like I got and snails fish snails shrimp and all and everything else And then a lot of plants. I just don't see it working people. I just I just I just really don't um, So that's my take on it um, Let me know what your comments are uh, below uh, will uh, plants uh, With a lot of fish in the tank and a lot of plants in the tank will it? Uh, actually take up a lot of ammonia because if it did take up a lot of ammonia if plants really did do that with a well stocked tank with fish then if that is the case uh, and it's doing a full cycle then why are we running our filters on our fully planted tanks why are we doing that if it, if, if, it, if it truly does do that um, I'm going to tell you what I'm not going to stop running my filters on my planet tank and I guarantee you a lot of other people won't stop doing it either. So if they truly do that, take up a lot with a lot of fish in the tank. So just something to think about. All right, let me know what your comments are down, down below. Do, do plants in a well-stocked fish tank with a, with a lot of fish and a lot of plants, will they take up a lot of ammonia? Have a nice day. That's just a thought from Marcus uh, with Aquarium Hacks. Keep on hacking, folks.